Adventure bikes, what's with them? They're all the rage these days, big expensive adventure bikes. Uh, for purposes of this test, we got some less expensive ones, uh, maybe maybe urban adventure bikes, we're gonna call them. And this time we got the Honda NC700X. Uh, this is the DCT ABS version, which means it's got a dual clutch automatic transmission. It comes with, with anti-locked brakes. Uh, and it comes with, with a $2,000 higher price tag than the manual shift version which almost takes it out of the, out of the, out of the realm of affordable, but not quite. Um, the, the, the DCT transmission works great. It, it, it doesn't work perfectly. Uh, it's close. If you can't operate a clutch and you don't want to learn, it makes it the Honda's the only game in town. Uh, maybe, maybe otherwise you could do better with a clutch in your left foot. Uh, otherwise, the Honda's a really nicely put together, beautiful motorcycle. It's got this storage compartment that nothing else like it has. Put a full face helmet in it. Extremely handy for getting around, stopping at the grocery store, stuff like that. Runs great, awesome little motorcycle. As good as it is though, uh, it's not gonna win this comparison uh, just because of the higher price and the fact that the DCT is not quite there, it's very close. Um, the bike that's not here, the NC700X that was on our cover a couple months ago, with the manual transmission for $69.99. If that one had been here, it might have been a different story entirely. <laughs>